Hey folks, Agent CEO here, and I want to do a quick follow-up on our $278 PTZ. First off, be on the lookout for a third follow-up video because I actually have a $80 joystick that's coming in, and we're going to be testing that out because a bunch of y'all have asked about that. But I wanted to revisit something that I um, incorrectly did in the video, and that's actually pairing this up with the PTZ Optics um, app that can actually control it. So let's go ahead and cut over to the desktop. All right, so we are here. I actually have the camera um, connected through the camera app on the computer. So there we go. And um, I actually have it connected over a joystick right now. You can see me controlling this right now. But I want to come over and use the PTZ Optics app as well too. So this was something that I messed up on here um, because I actually had to set some permissions on my computer for that. That is just some USB stuff there. I had to turn off USB power management. After I did that, I was able to control it. So we're gonna come up here to settings, go to multiple cameras, and we're just gonna pick whichever camera. I'll set this to number three, have it point to the USB camera, which is right there. Hit okay. And now we're just gonna hit that button right here that I renamed. And now, as you can see, we can control this by using the mouse. Now, I do have my joystick here. So, if we come in here to additional inputs, let me actually turn the Xbox controller on. Alright, so, let's sync it up right now. And, let's come out of here, let's go back again go so now still not the coolest of controlling that's using the, the analog stick but using the d-pad works a lot better for me so again the ptc optics app can control the camera over USB. So again, thank y'all all for who actually have used this camera and you say that you actually use this app to control it. So that's cool. But again, be on the lookout for a cheaper joystick to see if that will work with this camera as well. And the link will be down below. And you make sure you won't miss that if you have the bell notification on. So if you like this type of content, appreciate a like, consider subscribing, hit that bell. That way you get notified when we come out with other videos to help Modernize your media ministry. Thanks for watching, folks. This is AJ. We'll catch you on the next video. Later.